each your time. Rift time. I still need to work on getting those starting soon screens. I'm still trying to determine if I want to make them myself or commission somebody for them, but we'll see what happens. Anyways, uh, the lore. Yippee. Salutations, voices of the void. I have been quite busy. I have been out and about on adventures, exploring more of this world that we find ourselves trapped in. I've yet to explore where this treasure is, or where this note of note is. It's just a ruined portal, coordinates, if you're interested. And I have reconnected, we already know this, but I have reconnected with the Mushroom Island that I stumbled upon early on. And we have a lot more crops there now. Otherwise, not much else of note. I have been alerted that other people have woken up. Which is interesting. Theoretical new allies against the Abyss is always a good thing. I wonder if I wonder if Angel and Taddy received my notes. Oh dear. That is not going to be good. I am still not used. I'm still not used to Enderman teleporting. I am thankful that I am not allergic to water like Enderman. I've also set up a fishing nook. Fishing is quite useful. It was mostly an excuse to expand my glowberry collection. <coughs> I do not even need more apples. I have plenty. Let's see what we get from the harvest. That is honestly more than I was expecting. Glowberries do not tend to yield a lot. Let us... Let us head over to Watcher's Tundra. Perhaps there is something we could do over that way. It is good to see the shrine still standing. I was honestly expecting a handful of people to have it torn down by now. 
Namely, this gubby individual who keeps tormenting me over the communicator. Has that bridge always been there? Last I saw it, it was just a dirt path. Intriguing. It is certainly better than that dirt path. No offense to Caden. Caden does tend to rush things. He is always on the move. That was also not there last I was here. He is doing his best. I did not mean that as an insult. Experience has taught me to investigate anything that glows. Yes, indeed, person. Simons and Bar Mechanic. Intriguing. I did not know that bars needed mechanics. And who is this Simon's and? Mailbox. We do not have a clear way of communication outside of the communicator. Perhaps establishing some kind of mail system is in order. Let us take a look. This is some interesting instruction. One moment. Uh, hello? Hello. Uh, I don't think we've met. We have not. I am the Oracle. Oh, you're the Oracle. You're the one everyone's been talking about. Well, it's a pleasure to meet you. My name is Simon. Welcome to my, uh, my bar and mechanics. I am an alchemist. Oh, I read that sign completely wrong. Uh, what did... Oh. I was... Did you read it now? Simon's yes. and bar mechanic? Yes. I was... Yeah. Now that I think about it, it does not make sense for bars to have mechanics. It doesn't make sense, but eh, it works. It's what I'm used for. Use, useful for. My apologies. Hmm. Um, well, why don't I show you around in here? Uh, I should actually thank you. Uh, your building over there has been very helpful. I know you and Caden worked on that. Caden mostly worked on it. It was destroyed when we found it. Right, much like this, almost. Hmm. I also did not build it, it was my worshippers that built it. Right, the whole, uh, god thing. Alright, it's gonna get a little hard to get used to. Did your world not have gods? We did, but we only had, like, a few, and the people who worshipped them were more cults rather than followers. Intriguing. Anyway, uh, it's night out. I don't know if you're mortal, but I may as well show you my 
my place, so come on in. Sure. If you're ever in the area, please feel free to just come on in. All right. I've got a um, pressure plate, so you can just walk pretty much anywhere. Uh, I'll show you here first. So here's just a makeshift forge I've been working on. Uh, actually, I did want to mention something. Uh, have, was it Fairy was talking about netherite? Do you know anything about that? Yes. Because I have no clue what it is. It is a material created from a combination of ancient debris and gold. Right. Um, I'm probably not using the correct method, because I tried combining these and these, and it didn't seem to work for me. Maybe I'm doing something wrong? Maybe it's a different combination? I'm not too sure. Well, your first step is that you only need four of each. Right. I just had an extra left over. Hmm. Why is that not working? That is supposed to be working. Is that another thing our captor has set off? I do not believe so. Hmm. Interesting. Well, I mean, if it's not working for you, then I guess something's wrong. I have found out what is wrong. What is wrong with it? I think our captor accidentally messed up the crafting recipe. Oh, so... Huh, Give me one moment. I have to that mess is... with an outside communicator to notify them of this. Oh, uh, that's god talk. Okay. Um, while you're doing that, I'll um, I'll get some of my other things. I had a lot to ask you. I'll keep it brief, though. Don't want to overwhelm you with human, who has so much to talk about. Fire away. Um, the main thing I had was um, in your or in the hotel, I've been noticing a bunch of red chests in people's rooms. Each of these had a note. I didn't look into each of them. I'm just guessing that each of them had a note because mine had a note. Mm -hmm. It's actually incredibly ironic that I find you now and not before. Because they also had gifts in them. I will give you that to just read. Um, gifts, quote-unquote. There was, like, copper nuggets and bottles in mine. I'm not sure why. And I was going to ask you if it would be wise to use them or not, but I actually found another gift from our captor, which uh, made me throw everything away, except the book. Interesting. I am uncertain of the nature of these gifts, but they should be all right. Okay. It is clear it just... they are from our captor, however. I hmm, recognize I've... that signature. I pieced it together because of the eyes. I think the being has heterochromia, probably why it has the purple and green and signs purple and green. That's... I don't know. That is correct. Anyhow, um, I guess we'll figure out what uh, what our captor has done with the netherite afterwards. Um, it is strange. I have not received a red box with an ominous note or gifts. It seemed to be exclusively to the hotel, so I'm not entirely sure if you would have gotten one. But then again, I don't know. Oh, that's just my to-do list. I haven't... I've worked on some of them. I see. I actually uh did man I did make wine uh just a bit ago. I've been working on alcohol recently since I've been here. We do have alcohol here. I did uh want to figure out how to make it in case the yeast and the you know the whole process is different here. Um I made some if that's of any interest to you. Alcohol is always of interest to me. I actually have something that I've been aging for a little bit. It's only like about a week or two, but I made some mead. Fantastic. Oh, thank you very much. It still needs to be worked a little bit, but uh, I am working on making a quote unquote ager for the alcohol just to make it like age quicker. 
though see. I'm still working on that. It needs glowstone and stuff. I'll have to work out the specifics of that. Well, there is a, ne there is a portal to the nether on my island, if that interests you. I actually did um, visit your island when I awoke. Uh, Caden, Fairy, and Taddy took me. I, see. I didn't mean to intrude if that was uh, of any all is indication well. that I intruded. All are welcome at my island. It is a sanctuary. Very kind of you. Hmm. Um, basically, uh, this is just a to-do list. Um, I need to make a bunch of stuff. I did find some rubies, but... Um, I'm not sure how the teleport thing works. Uh, I'll... That's magic, I'm guessing? What kind of rubies? Yeah, uh, I have them on me. I have these. Uh, I found them on the... Like, just in caves and stuff, so I don't know if they're any use or if they're a different type, because you said witch. These are... different. Okay, different compositions, so I'm guessing the nether ones have more arcane energy in them, per chance, maybe? Yes. Okay. Well, I'll just figure out what to do with them, then. No one said oh. that we couldn't use our sense toys against him. Even though it's I don't remember just to make traversal us... easier. Our sense the captor, I'm guessing. I don't remember hearing his name. Oh yes, Arsene is the aspect of the abyss. Right, so it captain. has a name. Okay. <laughs> I'll have to update. Um, I have a journal, sorry. I've been writing everything down since I've been here. All is well. Uh, anyway, in here, I don't know if you ever need it, but there is a guest room. I don't know if that's of any use to you. Uh, I have a room that's just there too. I mean, if you need it, too. Uh... I am not certain that I would need it, for I have the islands as well as mm. a little getaway. Of course, of course. Uh, in there is just some storage, so nothing interesting. Uh, in here is a kitchen. Feel free to use anything in here. Uh, I have some, like, utensils over here. Uh, I have some brewing stands. I don't have blaze powder yet, because I haven't been able to find a blaze. I'm guessing that's this world's thing. Uh, yes. In my world, they're fire elementals, so that's been a bit of an adjustment. Mm, I see. In here, I have like a pantry. I don't know if you need seeds or anything, or just food. I have seeds downstairs if you need them. Uh, I mean, feel free to take whatever. I appreciate I've been... the kindness, but I am not certain I will need seeds for there is the mushroom farm. Does the mushroom farm have a wide variety of seeds? Indeed. Because I've got quite a large variety in case you wanted to take some for it, if you're missing any. Inside of that book is a list of everything I have made a note of at the mushroom farms. Okay, um... I will probably go through this and see if there's anything that we... that you don't have, but you probably have a lot. You've been around longer than I have. Um, okay. uh, there, there is a ledger at the mushroom farms. That is just oh, my copy. Oh. Uh, sorry, I'll just give you that then. Yep. Uh, and anyway, down here is uh, where I've been making my cellar. So this is where that um, aging machine that I mentioned was going to go. I see. I have to work on that, so... It should, if my calculations are correct, roughly age it by two to three years. Oh, uh... I was just checking out the mechanism. Oh, I was just... The teleporting thing's a little weird. Yes, my apologies. Teleport. All is well. Uh, anyway, in here uh, we have some rum, and in here we have another mead. I'm still working on making more space so I can put some wine. Because there's a lot of fruit here that I haven't actually seen before that I could probably make into wine. Intriguing. Uh, and over here was my poor attempt at a... Uh, I was going to make a fast growing machine thing down here, but uh, due to some circumstances, it didn't work the way I wanted it to, so I'm just leaving those. 
Fair enough. Actually, I should probably probably just take that. Decoration. Uh, on here though, we have some seeds, and then you have like some fruit, vegetables, etc. But um, yeah. Aside from that, that's kind of just it. That's my place. It is very well put together. Thank you. I've spent uh the last couple days working on it. It is very nice. And it is very Thank good you. that we have alcohol. Finally, I can consume something that isn't milk and water. How long has it been since you've had alcohol, roughly? That is a good question. We'll just say a long time. How about that? Time tends to run together when you're millions of years old. Yeah. That's another thing I've got to get used to, uh, used to with... um. Gods and other such beings. Yes. There are many primordial forces out there. I have met a handful of them. Not too many, though. Nothing, no one notable. Or not, nothing notable, sorry. Obviously, everyone's notable, but like, you know, gods, etc. Oh, yes. Leave it away. Where are my emeralds split? In exchange oh, nice. for the meat that you have gifted me, I too have a gift for you. For me? Oh, what is... What is this? A chorus flower. Huh. That's... I have no clue what it is, but I appreciate your gift. I thank you for it. It is a special kind of fruit where I am from. You consume it, and oh. it randomly teleports you. It is a fun little game. I could potentially make something out of that. Hopefully, if it if the aging process doesn't dilute the teleportation from it. Uh, I'll figure something out, but I appreciate that. Thank you. I will get to figuring it out. Very well. I take it you have already been given a tour of the world. I have been given a tour pretty much of the world. The Mushroom Islands I'm not too sure of. I had, That's very new to me, but um, everything else pretty much, yes. I have. That is fair. I have only recently added the teleportation to that area. Right. Okay. I wanted to make sure it was suitable before I allowed access to it. That's fair. That's actually quite responsible. If you ever find anywhere that you think is necessary for teleportation, come find me and I will add a teleportation conduit. Nothing, no problem. I will keep that in mind. So I'm guessing you've met basically everyone who's been here? As far as I am aware, yes, I've met everyone. And yet we're still no further to a out, I'm guessing, because you've been here much longer than a lot of others. I have tried everything. Before I lost mm. the ability to shift through dimensions, I tried to shift through the sky. Nothing. Huh. It's that just would... this. We'll need to, at some point, eventually maybe have another crack at what we've already tried. Perhaps. But something but that's for later. That is for later. But something tells me that there just is no escape. And even if there is, there's nothing to escape to. Yeah, I mean, from what everyone knows, their worlds are gone. This is the Mushroom Farms. Wow, this looks really nice. I like the, the lanterns. <gasps> yes. You alright? I am fine. I think... I've just been eating too many apples lately. Ah, oh, yeah. No, I, I get that sometimes. If you ever find a seed that is not in there, if you could leave at least one in the chest, we can add it to the box. I will probably have a look later and do that. The only thing that I have not yet added is mushrooms. Oddly hmm. enough. They are kind of around. But we have... Nice, convenient storage for anything that 
one might want. I like tea, blackberries. I still don't know how to pronounce this, but that. It's a tomatillo. It is a tomat tomatillo, tomatillo, if you were to pronounce it as it originates, but most people call it a tomatillo. Understandable. I actually just took a guess at that. I had no clue. But yes, it's very nicely, so. very nicely uh, organized. I am very particular about the way I organize things. I respect it. What's what's this? Oh, this is uh, rice. That's right. Yes. Thank you. Mm -hmm. And here we have the animals, as well as storage. Right. Everyone seems to have some sort of animals in their section. Well, I do not think ah. it would be a farm without animals. Very true. These, these rabbits are under, like, intense prison. They will attempt to escape. Uh, okay, I getcha. I have been known to do that in my world as well. Some rabbits have also just started to randomly disappear. I had to go to Caden's little animal storage and replace them. Like, like some twisted magic trick, or? I suppose so. I know some phony street magicians would do that, but didn't think that was actually possible. But yes, if you too ever have need for anything, there is always extra stored here. Okay, I will keep that in mind. Thank you. I do not recommend taking the poisoned potatoes, however. That would seem kind of pointless. Huh. I do not know anyone that would actually be able to eat them. Except me. I don't. I don't think the consistency of the poison potato would actually benefit. Ow. I'm okay. As long as you are alright. I heal quick. I. Hear that? It's very weird. You can interact with a lot of these crops, and they will just pop out of the ground, but otherwise you have to destroy them. I have found that with some of them. That was my intention for my, um, my little farm thing downstairs. But they seem to not like redstone or mechanics either, hmm. so I turned that off. Fair enough. It must be from the worlds they stem from. A lot of these I have not seen, so I mean, understandable. I am still trying to find out where these eggplants came from. And, and... Oh yeah, I have seen one of those. I still don't know why it is labeled an eggplant. Well, it's not just that, but I have never stumbled upon eggplants. Neither have I. They just appeared here one day. Hmm. Huh. So, you've been here for that long, and stuff just appeared? Yes. As if, like, it never was here, and then it just decided to appear out of thin air. That's... odd. That is indeed odd. Maybe they... Oh, actually, that would make a little bit of sense if... Because our captor, quote-unquote, consumes things. Maybe it consumes the seeds needed for all of these. Perhaps. Then again, I have no clue. I wonder if it is some kind of prank from our sin. But what does the oh. eggplant mean? I don't know. I mean... I think I heard some people... Oh, I've been talking to um. These echo things. Uh, you know how we have our communicators? Or telepathy for some people? Yes. Uh, I found a second... Panel? 
quote unquote, uh, a second, a second uh, communication system. So I've been calling them echoes. I know some people call them other things. Uh, they called them an aubergine. A what? I have no clue what it was. They just, I picked it up and one of them went, that is an aubergine. And I questioned it. I do not and then they didn't elaborate. That is interesting. I do not... I do not even know what that is. I have absolutely no clue. My echoes tend to mess with me a bit. Hmm. My... My source of communication with external means, I have dubbed the voices of the void. For I hear That's them through my mask. I was meaning to ask you about that. I have noticed two people wearing masks, and I wanted to ask, um... You wouldn't happen to know someone by the name of The Masked King, would you? No. Okay. Perhaps um, some of my followers called me that, but no. I'll give you a quick rundown, because he's, he's a fucking weird being. Um, to give you a rundown, he was a being who spoke so endlessly of other worlds and seemed to have a link to every life that he had in those worlds. I just thought if someone had like a connection, I could at least relate to someone, but it's like a long shot. Perhaps. I've never heard such tales. We always knew there were other worlds where I'm from. He was the only sort of link to any other worlds that I could think of, but I didn't even know of other worlds till like a couple weeks ago. That seems to be the case with many people here. Hmm. A lot of people do seem to be from very differing worlds. It's very interesting to hear, like, how different each world is compared to each other. Yes, indeed. Pardon, I am reorganizing uh, a bit. That is all good. I've been organizing my backpack for a bit. I store things in the empty void of my mask. That's handy. It helps that my eye sockets are literal portals, uh, literal portals to the void. That is, in that's interesting. If you don't mind me asking, how then do you see? You probably actually get that a lot, but I'm curious. Do you see the? Purple glows in my eye sockets. I do, yeah. Those That's are faint, but yeah. my eyes. Uh. Or if I take huh. the mask off. Oh. That's a sight. There is nothing there. There is absolutely nothing there. You also probably get this a lot, but I'm not going to. There was an urge to put my hand in there. I'm not going to, because that would be very disrespectful. It is a solid surface. If you were to put your hand on it, you would feel my flesh. Huh, okay. But if you stick okay. your fingers in the eye sockets, you will pull them out and they will be very cold. Huh. Strange. Uh, strange in a cool way, not strange in a... I mean, I, I take no offense. It's hard to get used to what people take offense to or not. I, I don't do... want to come off as too harsh or too rude to people. I do not take offense to many things. I appreciate that. I'll still not try and offend you regardless. It is appreciated. I'll help out with this. Sorry, I've been letting you do all this. I should be helping out a tad. All is well. 
I've simply been collecting to stock the barn for people who might want it. That's understandable. Uh, I will... I should perhaps also add an arboretum over here. A... I'm not sure what that is. A place where you can grow many kinds of trees. Oh, right, 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 right. Granted, we have the fruit trees, but those are not exactly meant for cutting down. Hmm, no. Um... One of my echoes is mentioning something. Oh, uh, yeah, I, I do. We're currently doing lore at the moment, but yes. Yes, I do. Just off, um, just off lore for a second, Void, just ask if uh, I play with Coda, you. Oh, yeah. Yeah. We friends, we chillin' or whatever. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 3 2 one lore. Uh... You... Oh, there it is. Looking for chilies. It is almost a compulsion on how well organized I keep things. So I... I respect it. My stuff's just disorganized at the moment. I need to really work on that. Uh, what else can I put away? Put away. We were, deal with that. we were talking about other individuals. Who all have you met thus far? Thus far, I have met in order. Uh, I have met Caden. He's very nice. Uh, a lot of them are very nice from what I've met, except for one. Uh, I've met Caden. I have met Fairy. I met Taddy. And I met Kirha. Intriguing. Her was, uh, I don't want to be rude, but came off very bold and very aggressive. That is Kira for you. Hmm. I understand people are from different worlds, so it may be different customs, but I felt more they were attacking more in a sense. I get they weren't meaning to, but it came off as such. I cannot get a decent read on Kira. Ah, so it's not just me. That's a relief. <laughs> Other than that, they are incredibly rude to me for some reason. Ah, so it's literally not just me. Okay. I thought they had a problem with me because, um, I get the vibe that Hayden and Barry were talking. It's confusing whether, um, whether Kira is Spider being or not, because they kept saying yes, they kept saying no, it's... Yeah. I don't get good vibes from them anyhow. They are... a unique specimen. You can say that again, yeah. I do not want to make assumptions because I do not want to be wrong. Understandable, yes. I just have a a bad sense that they are. It's not a bad thing for anyone else, just personally. I have a history with arachnids. I see. It's a mutual thing. They will come and attack me for no reason, and I'll... Well, there is reason, but I won't get into it. But they will just attack me out of the blue, and then I'll attack them, they'll see it as revenge, yada yada yada. Hmm. Vengeful little things. My few interactions with spiders have always been rather pleasant. I just usually should... leave them to their own vices. I attempt to. But then they decide to just want to bite me anyway. Hmm. 
interesting they even had that opinion in a completely separate world. I see. What was your world like? I've heard some tales of other people's worlds, but what was yours like? My world was... It was composed of several different dimensions, for one. Right. I, more often than not, kept myself in the end. Right, I'm still not sure what that place is. That's still very new to me, but I'll learn eventually. The end is a dimension of unending void. Huh. I was created by mortals to serve as a god of protection. Because gods are... Some gods appear like that, don't they? They materialize, but some appear on their own, from what I'm aware. All of the gods of my world were created through sheer belief. If the people will believed... into existence? What was that? Sorry, willed into existence by chance? That is certainly one way to put it, yes. Sorry, I also keep interrupting you, my apologies. All is well. Some gods were, of course, created first. How else would the world exist? Mm. But, in certain instances, some gods could be simply created. I was one of those gods. Mm. People needed something to protect them from the various evils of the world. I was created. That would have been very handy back on my world. We had endless evils. Yes, well, it appears that I am not really good at my job. Uh, you're. Weren't you willed to be that? I don't understand how you're not good at your job. If I was good at my job, would I be here? Yeah, I mean, you can't argue that point. I am certain I was a fantastic god, and I helped people across the world, across the dimensions. But I could mm. not handle the abyss on my own. It does seem to be a lot stronger than people have been thinking. Some people have been saying it has, like, unthinkable levels of power. I imagine... Eldritch, somewhat. I don't know what that word means, but yeah. I imagine it would be stronger than a god, considering it has swallowed several. Hmm, I'm aware of U and EJ, which here are called Alphabet. Uh, I'm not sure any others, though. Well, there was a... Salamander, I think. Salamander god, or salamander full stop? Well, it was a salamander god. They did not like the cold very much, and thrived in the heat of the nether. Right. It is very likely that... I believe they themselves were a god, because they were talking about something something destroying their world and recreating it. That sounds more like a destructive god, rather than... I mean, there are gods for almost everything, I, from what I'm guessing, but that seems... not like what a god would do. But I'm not one, so I don't know. Not all gods are kind. But I do not get bad vibes from all. Okay, I think I did hear... Alm's name being thrown around, but I'm not sure. I do not get bad vibes from them. I think they were simply a victim of circumstance. 
Well, if you don't get bad vibes, that's definitely a blessing. Yes. So, aside from this, what sort of projects are you doing to keep yourself busy? I have a mine, but it is secret. Understandable. Won't ask questions. Other than that, I occasionally check the hole from time to si time to see if more people awaken. Yeah. I interact with the locals when they are around, but it seems to be a rather quiet day. It seems to be rather quiet for a while. I've only really met the handful of people I've met. I've been... haven't seen anyone else. Either they're off adventuring, trying to find their remnants as well, or just, I don't know, elsewhere. It is possible. I'm surprised my remnant was very close. But also, it's cold, which I mean I hate, so that could be a spit in the face. Perhaps. Things tend to just appear. Hmm. wonder if anything else will appear. It is quite possible. I should definitely adventure more. All of these holes are discomforting. Yeah. Um I do I have a background in adventuring. I could probably take a direction, map some chords down, or map some like sights down, see. It and then be, let you know. It would be a good idea. Okay, I will keep that in mind when I'm adventuring. Are you in anything in particular, or are you just anything, doesn't matter? Anything is fine. Okay. Could probably add two more slots against this wall. Mm. Yes, I can. I'll I hop would, on the other side. I would not keep the rubies. I will give them to you, I do not want to handle them if... If they're from some sort of arcane energy, I don't want to touch them. That is fair. I have had my experience with arcane energy, but it's not in my blood, so I can't control it myself. I suppose a lot of us would not have that kind of blessing. Especially in my world. Uh, in my world, people... You had to have a certain type of blood to even be able to use magic. I see. I was not lucky enough to get that type, but I have the type of blood that allows me to use artifacts. Such as, like, uh... I don't know an example off the top of my head, but, like, let's say a ring that can make you invisible for a bit. Intriguing. But from what I can see here, that doesn't seem to matter. Which I'm grateful for. It was kind of a, an unfair advantage. Indeed. What did you do with the other rubies? I, I handed them to you. You picked them up. Oh. I was not paying attention. That's alright, I kind of didn't tell you. I kind of threw them at you. you. There are a couple of other important biomes that we have not yet quite discovered. There is, from what I have seen, there was a jungle and... Mostly ocean, surprisingly. This world is very water-filled. Well, the jungle would be important, I think. There are plenty of natural resources out that way. 
I don't remember which way that was, but I will... I'll find another one. I am certain we... one of us will stumble upon one. I've yet to see a single desert, too. It has all been mostly beach. I was actually looking for a desert, um, not that long ago. Couldn't find one. Literally have no clue. And also, despite all of this snow, there are not many tigers around. Tigers or tigers? Tiger. T-A-I-G-A. -A. Right, right, right. That's a new word. <laughs> I've heard it in passing, I haven't actually. I didn't bother to listen. <laughs> It is essentially a spruce wood forest. Okay. I mean, not that we'll need spruce wood, but I mean, I planted a lot of trees behind the hotel. We could also fill some of these holes with much further out remnants. That would be an idea. Like, um, if we perchance found, like, I don't know, DJ's remnant or Fairy's remnant. I don't know if I'm just spitballing. I don't know if they found those or not. I am not certain. Because I didn't find any. Like I went pretty much. Uh, I went which uh, like south and then I went east. I went in a couple directions, died, which fucking hurt. Then uh, I got brought back. Interesting. This Arsene seemed to not appreciate me exploring, from what I could tell. He tends to mess with anyone when it's convenient for him. He does want me to keep my nose out of, my, out of other people's business, so I mean, fair enough. doesn't sound like him to force politeness on others. Oh, absolutely not, especially seeming he gave me a box of spider bits. Oh. Uh, I will... As I mentioned, I have a thing against spiders. Um, he gave me a box full of just freshly killed spider bits. It was filled to the brim. I see. Which I, I was not quite sure if that was supposed to be impressive or supposed to intimidate. I got really mixed feelings from that. Knowing or send it was likely to intimidate. Probably. Oh, yes. You can have this coal I dug up. I have plenty oh. elsewhere. Oh, thank you. I appreciate that. Hmm. Well, I mean... You seem like you got your work cut out for you. Uh, if you do need me to do literally anything, uh, I have my mailbox. Just chuck me a note. Yes, I was actually thinking about establishing some kind of mail system. I know I'm pretty much the only person I could see who had a mailbox, as our son decided to put those red chests in people's rooms. We could have, like, a post office. It would be a good idea. Maybe people who were bored enough take turns, see what letters are in there, give them to people. Yes. I'll have a talk with a couple other people, because I think, um... I don't know, I think Taddy mentioned something when we were... We were planting uh, cinnamon trees recently, and they mentioned something about that. I see. If there's cinnamon here, then perhaps we could also make some snickerdoodles. Those cookies are worth uh, dying for. I have absolutely no idea what that is, but that sounds great. It is kind I... of like a cinnamon sugar cookie. Let me see. I have a um, book here. Uh, does not... I would receive them quite often as... Uh, blessings. Not blessings. Worship. Okay. People would leave me gifts. <laughs> Understandable. Uh, those seem pretty easy to make. Do you want to make some? Perhaps at some other point. Okay, well if I make some, I can hand you some. That sounds good. Let 
My echoes keep calling you people. That is strange. The voices of the void keep calling me that, too. But that usually translates to grandfather, of which I have never even had any children. That would... That's... I don't know how that translates to that, but sure. Maybe the voices and the echoes are one and the same. They just communicate differently. Perhaps. I never really thought about it that way. I have not either. I just thought it was communication interference because I kept getting messages that weren't from anyone using a communicator. Hmm. Oh, uh, I didn't actually read that one. Uh, one of them called you an alcoholic, confirmed. I do not know if I could technically be defined as an alcoholic, for I cannot get drunk. That is actually... I never thought about that, yeah. Uh, I'm just gonna say no. I don't think you count as one, if you cannot get drunk. I suppose by definition it just means I consume a lot of alcohol, but... It usually has a negative connotation to it. Negative connotation? Like the word? The alcoholic word? Yes. Oh, yes, yeah. Alcoholics back in my world were drunken taverns all the time. I could experience a buzz, but I would never get to that point. I would simply just get giggly. Is that due to just, I don't know, um, god resistance, or is that a regeneration thing? It is likely a regeneration thing. I know plenty of gods who could get drunk. I mean, I am well, a that's... god of protection. Is that, by definition, only for combat, or does that have other connotations? If you can think of a definition for protection, it is likely for that. Anytime something bad would happen, they would call upon me for protection. Be it huh. they needed somebody to comfort them through trying times, or they needed somebody to aid them through war. Okay. So that encompasses more than just combat. That's handy. Yes. Does your powers work on your followers? Like, I mean, based on the amount of followers, worshippers you have. All gods function on belief. If hmm. there is little to no belief, there is little to no power. So that's kind of sucky right now, then, for you. I am very mortal right now. I can die. That is unfortunate. I also used to be able to shift through dimensions, but now all I have is this lousy Enderman teleport. I mean, I've found a couple of those if you aim them right. It is useful, yes. I do not get harmed from them like mortals do. Yeah, those hurt. Luckily, I've made a natural uh, regeneration thing in my arm, so I can just, if I'm damaged, instantly heal. That is good. I've had a lot of time to think about what to put in this arm. I've noticed there are a couple of people here with things going on with their arm. You mine, what? mine went missing. So I mean, I don't know about. Oh, sorry. If you want to have a look, I was looking. Yes, metal. I made this myself. I was actually deemed a genius in my world for it because I was the first person to make a fluid prosthetic. I see. Fluid is in like fluid motion. Yes. I I would I would yeah. assume that it would not be liquid. That would not work well yeah. as an arm. I had to clarify that to a couple people who were not too sure what fluid movement meant. Though Caden's odd arm situation does tend to move like fluid. That is likely that... due to the fact that it is com 
composed of shadows. Which was very interesting to hear, because that's like shadow magic, from what I'm from my world at least. I don't know if it's called that here. I would not know. I am not from Caden's world. Oh, right, I keep forgetting that you two are not from the same world. I don't know why I keep linking you two. I could not tell you. I think it's just because you woke up after him. Shortly after? You two built the hotel, that's probably what I'm linking together. He built the hotel. You know I, what I mean, it's your- yeah. The only hand I had in the whole hotel business is it was my shrine and I gave him permission to do so. Yeah, that's sort of what I meant. I didn't word that correctly. All is well. Yeah, well, uh, I should probably put that on my to-do list, seeming I've... I can remove the wine thing. Uh, hopefully our captor fixes the netherite thing, and I'll... I mean, I'll get back to you, but, um... If I'm able to do that. Hopefully. Just to confirm. Hopefully. Uh, that would be good. Do you need me to help you with anything else aside from what we just said right now, or...? I do not think so. Okay. Um... Yeah, well, I mean, if... If that's kind of all that we can really think of, I might get started on that. I, I, might, as, I might as well. That's probably an idea. Hopefully we can get some more stuff. I'll eventually talk to Taddy. I haven't seen Taddy in ages. I'll need to hopefully talk to them about that post office. I was planning on getting started on it as soon as I could. Actually, if we wanted to make the foundations for it, we can go do that. Find a nice spot. Because it, I mean, wherever you want to put it, really. It should be sort of central, I don't know. I, do I don't not, know where everyone is. I do not know if I want it to be... here. No, not here, that would be... Given the whole Watcher's Tundra or Sen's Eyes thing. Right yeah, that would not... I don't think he mat it matters, he sees all. Yeah, it wouldn't matter, but, you know, we want a little bit of privacy from those eyes. Perhaps we can make it out towards Stilt Village. That could be an idea. Ooh, that would be a nice, like having a little on-the-water post office. Perhaps not necessarily on the water, but... Well, whatever works, honestly. I don't mind as long as we have one. Closer to here, but far enough away that we could probably put a button to it. Mm. That way it will be centralized in a safe location and have quick access to everywhere it needs. Yeah. Sorry, I was just noticing there was a, a shipwreck over there. Oh, and you're gone. Ah, fuck it, come and do. Oh, I see it. I'd use my um, spy glass to see it. I saw something on the distance, couldn't make out what it was. I think I have already explored this, but we will see. There are odd gaps in my memory. I think it is just a... An unfortunate circumstance of becoming mortal. Trust me, mortals forget a lot of things. Some wish they could forget. Ironically enough. There is a treasure map. Oh. Let me see this. Is this different from the one that I am currently holding? Yes. Huh. So you haven't explored this, or you might have and maybe not take that? I am unsure. 
mean, we can go and explore it. Well, it has certainly been explored before because this chest is empty. I think maybe whoever was here just missed it. Oh, maybe they missed it, yeah. Oh, dear. I've noticed that one in the water. Uh oh. Goodbye. And now I'm. There we are. Uh, let me make a boat. Not that we need it, but we may as well grab one just in case. Hmm. You know. This would not be a bad spot for it. Oh. You are being chased by an Enderman, surprisingly. Yeah, I do not know why they are mad at me. They are likely one of our sins, if not one of mine. I'm going to quickly put on my armor. I need to repair this. That's it. Knife. Nope. Thank you for the assist on that. Yes. This would not be a bad spot for it. Flatten it I think out we should. Bit. Yeah, actually, we might. Uh, I'll light it up a little, and we can. We can change the torches. I'm just going to place just some down. Excuse me. No, thank you. Ow. That was one way to do that. I mean, it gets the job done. Okay, and that should be okay. It definitely needs to be lit up a bit more, but it's fine for now. Indeed. Hey, and that one's gone. I hardly felt any of that. You must be pretty resistant to damage them, as the god of protection. It would indeed make sense. It was... I don't remember who it was, but somebody had mentioned that I do not look like... I think it was actually Taddy. I'd mentioned that I do not look like much of a god of protection, for I do not wear armor. I mean, I can see where they would be coming from with that, as the god of protection should be, or in their eyes, like, guarded themselves. You do seem pretty unarmed, even though you are pretty resilient in yourself. Well, that would be because our sin broke my sword. You have been carrying around a hill, I've noticed. Is that of any significance, or...? I found it in my ender chest. Hmm. See, that appears to be to the west. Which direction would be west from here? That way. I'm going to go investigate this ch this map real quick. Oh good, I will keep uh, filling up this land. Let me know if you find anything. I will. Oh dear. Everything all good? Yeah, so Sen has, uh... Quote-unquote, fun new minions. Oh no, is it those ghouls? No. I am not concerned about them in the slightest. I think and it has I left have... me alone. Wait, is it those stupid underwater things that throw things at you? No, it was not a drowned. It was a sunken skeleton. Oh, I don't want to deal with that. That sounds bad enough. At least that is what I am calling it. I mean, if that's what. If it did something like shoot at you, I'm gonna guess, yeah. It seems that skeletons and zombies. Have picked their own way of attack. Indeed. 
maybe the skeletons as such were archers before they died and zombies were just civilians. I Hence have... why... I've seen a handful oh. of skeletons with swords. Huh. I have going... yet to see one. I'm now going north. I need to go west. To be fair, I didn't see many undead back in my world, so it's it was a little jarring. I do not acknowledge that. I'm not sure what that is. I do not acknowledge it. It is not ready for canon yet. I do not know what this canon is, but uh, sure. I'm going to elect to ignore it and continue to investigate this chest. Yeah, and... Oh, that is unfair. What happened? I have found a skeleton riding a spider. Oh, yes. They do exist, and they are rather mean. They are indeed mean. The spider wanted to kill me more than the skeleton did. Hmm. I am now getting further from it. Hello? Oh, that's because I wanted to go east, not west. I know my directions. My sense of direction's been a bit skewed since I've been here, too. Well, normally, like I said, I could just phase through dimensions, so direction was never a worry for me. And yeah, you would have... Power. You would have a time adjusting to that, yeah. Oh, what the fuck is that? I look... Oh, that thing threw things at me. It looks like a villager, but it's not. Oh, it's a witch, okay. And... I'm gonna throw those into the sea. Oh dear. It, uh, for some reason had spider's eyes on it. Probably because they are used in brewing. They are used for poison, yes. As unfortunate as that is. You can also ferment them to amplify the effects of certain other things. Ah, oh, so that's how that works here. It's different where I'm from. Where did all of my... Well, like... I guess I should hang on to them then, but I also don't want to. I'll deal with it next time. You do not have to deal with things you are not ready for. You know, that's actually... That's very nice, thank you. No one really... No one's really said anything like that. Well, I am the god of protection. It would only make that sense that I make people feel protected in certain aspects. That is true. You do definitely do a good job at that. I'm now closing in on this treasure. Thank I have you. pretty much flattened out a great chunk of land, so that we can decide to make it a bit deeper, or we can just put it where I put it. We will see where our hearts take us when we start construction. Indeed. Next will be material choice. Oh, well, isn't this a pleasant sight? Hmm? What is? Turtles. I have seen a couple of them. They just... they hang out. I have not seen many around. I have never really gone in this direction. According to the map, I should be just on top of this treasure. Uh, just one moment. There it is. Oh, delightful! I 
shall set some of these aside as offerings to someone. I no longer need this map, so I am content leaving it there. My apologies for going quiet if you had anything to say. Uh, Echoes had some pretty interesting questions. All is well. I have found the, tr the chest. Oh. Is there anything in it, from what you can see? It had iron fish, a heart of the sea, a water-breathing potion. Oh. There are also a few I'm... odds and ends in there that I am considering gifting to others. Understandable. I have no idea what a heart of the sea is, but that is interesting. It is used to make a conduit. I will have to look into that. I'm... Still unsure, but I'll figure it out. Do we want to leave this shipwreck here? Or do we want to leave that to whoever wants to build? We could leave it there. Maybe make like a little second post office thing. It would be nice to leave there as... A sort memento. of... Not necessarily a memento, but a uh, waypoint. So you know relatively, hey, this is a good direction. Right, right, right. That should be... That's actually an idea, yes. I am full of them. You have a lot of ideas I wouldn't even consider. Wisdom tends to come to those with age. Yeah, you are... R respectfully, you are old, right? I like, old up. I am millions yeah. of years old. Yeah. I could add another teleportation chamber over here as well to make... You know, getting around a little easier. That could be an idea. If that's easy enough to do, we can work on that, make a little thing. It would be relatively easy to do. For me, as it would. Hmm. I can... Probably eat those. Alright, well, right now I'll take that off. It's just far away enough from another teleportation conduit that... It would justify putting one here. We would want one here anyways as a means of... You know. Getting Quick here from... Stuff. Getting here from the one at Watcher's Tundra. It would be wise, yes. I... We have a... Oh, yep, you go. I was about to state that I was going to go gather some supplies. Understandable. Uh, do you want me to gra gather some too as well, or what would you like me to do? I think I will be alright in terms of construction. Okay. Well, uh, as you know, uh, post box, just anything you need, let me know. Of course. I will probably head back home then. It was very nice to meet you. I hope we can meet again at some point. A delight to meet you as well. I will be sure to make some more of that mead for you. Excellent. Right. I will see you next time. You as well. Bye. Bye. Post Office Island. We'll need to gather more ruby. But it will be... manageable, I think. Perhaps I could add the entrance to the teleportation hub. 
through this sunken ship. Give it a purpose beyond being here. Just looking old and decrepit. A nice place for people to leave things to be sent out to others. It will likely come in handy once we start establishing our own civilization. I shall get right to work. And that was lore. I don't know if Abyss is still going. I'm gonna check real quick. Yes, it appears Abyss is still going. All right, then I will not undeafen. But yeah, thank you guys so much for tuning in. Rift is really coming along, and I'm proud of it. I look forward to doing more. So thank you guys so much for tuning in. If you enjoyed what you saw and you're watching this on YouTube, please be sure to like, comment, share, favorite, subscribe, all that jazz. Follow me on Twitch if you aren't already. I also have a Twitter and a Tumblr. 20 followers away from Ocarina of Time, but every time I complain, I start over. Uh, be sure to go follow Abyss at twitch.tv slash eternal abyss. And until next time, ladies, gentlemen, and all matter of species between, peace out.